Hi guys, it's Sid. Welcome back to Vlogmas! Woo! Oh, in today's video, I'm gonna share my Spotify rap. Every single year, Spotify releases basically your listening statistics, the songs you listen to the most, the top artists that you had on your Spotify streaming list this year, and I'm so excited to look at mine because like this is always like the funnest thing to see what sort of music you were listening to, what sort of music you discovered this year, and uh, let's get right into it. Make sure to like and subscribe so you stay up to date on all the Vlogmas videos coming this December. All of them will be posted on Tuesday and Thursday throughout December, so keep an eye out and have my notifications turned on. Spotify is that one app that I have on my phone that I use every single day, no matter what. I wake up every single morning, Spotify. I go to bed, Spotify. This video is not sponsored by Spotify at all. I just really love the app, so let's get right into it. I listened to 206 new genres. What? Are we surprised that pop is literally the number one genre on there? I'm not surprised. Are you? <laughs> oh, okay. So my top song of the year is Black and White, Niall Horan. I just gotta say that Heartbreak Weather was like literally the best album I don't know this year one of my favorites like of all time that album literally has no skips I love her so much she is ugh and so when like Niall did the Royal Albert Hall live stream in November I lost my mind <laughs> It was such a good show. He did such a good job. And oh, oh, when Heartbreak Weather started that whole show, I was gone. Like the tears came down and she was crying. She was, oh. She streamed it 118 times. Was someone obsessed? Yes. Niall Stan, like literally <laughs> her top five songs this year. Literally, Niall, 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 Niall. <laughs> oh, when I said I was obsessed with Heartbreak Weather, I'm literally not joking. Look at this. Number one song, Black and White. Number two, Heartbreak Weather. Number three, Cross Your Mind. Fourth, No Judgment. And five, Everywhere. Um, Spotify is not wrong. <laughs> I feel like I woke up to that album at least for like three, four months straight because it was just so good. Like I said, there's literally no skips on that album. Oh, too good. <laughs> Julian the Phantoms, oh! Just because I like discovered it in the last half of the year, still, it, oh, oh my God, it's so good, so good. I'm so, oh, fully simping right now. Of course the top genre I listened to was 2000s Decade. Why wouldn't I listen to anything that was released? Uh, I do like the 80s and 70s a lot though. Like we like our good ABBA. We like, um, yeah, I pretty much like ABBA. Anyways. Well, I'm assuming if all my songs were Niall, I'm gonna say my top artist this year was Niall. What? What? How was my top artist? Taylor. What? Okay. I was in the top 0.5% of their listeners this year. Wow. Cool. Okay, yeah, Mirable is a really good song, not gonna lie. It is a good song. I just didn't know I listened to it that much. 782 artists? What? That's a lot of artists. <laughs> to 
me. Literally, Sean's not even on there. It's just funny. It's just like, rip. Also, he didn't release new music this year until like literally last month. So, okay, I know why the Jonas Brothers are second because back in April, all those shenanigans happened and uh, that's why we were streaming them a lot. Niall, that's so interesting that your top songs streamed don't like go into your top artists. That's weird. Anyways, cool, I like that. Why would they use Sean's song there? What? I literally, they literally just showed me that Sean wasn't even on my top artist, but they're playing If I Can't Have You. Okay. I'm also curious to what your guys' Spotify rap looks like. Leave it in the comments below. I'm really curious who your guys' top artists, genre, songs were for 2020. And if you haven't done your Spotify rap yet, I'll leave the link in my description as well so you can go check it out. Make sure to watch for new videos on Tuesdays and Thursdays throughout December for Vlogmas. Catch you guys next time. Jingle bell, jingle bell.